guys, it Mrs. Out. Kim's here. Welcome and welcome back to the vlog. Today I'm vlogging. Y'all, it is Memorial Day weekend. And I just figured I would just take y'all with me today. I'm just going to do spend the day with me. So it is early in the morning. Um, I am getting ready to record our podcast. So if y'all have not been listening, y'all need to make sure y'all listen to the podcast because it's really, really good. So I am at my cousin's house right now. Say hi, everybody. Say hi. <laughs> hi. What's the name of our podcast? Let me finish. Where the E in me is a number three. <laughs> Okay, and then um, today, I think it's kind of a juicy topic, but um, last week, y'all need to go listen to it. We talked about um, just what like is, having, what was it? What is the time to leave? I think the week before is the big Oh, one. the week before. Okay, so my two man, episodes man, ago, y'all need to go listen to it. We talked about, is it okay to have a relationship, a, like a close relationship? A friendship. A friendship. With somebody of the opposite so, sex. Of the opposite sex, yes. When you're married. When you're married, but the person is like single. single. Yeah. So like if your husband's best friend is a woman and they go out and have drinks and hang out all the time without you, like, is that okay? I said it wasn't okay. Everyone else had other opinions, it's... but apparently it was like a big deal. And like, um, there's this guy that my cousin works with and he wants to, for us to talk about it again. And he also wants to, um, call in. Add a male perspective. And add a male perspective. So I think that's what we're doing today. So that's what we got going on. So yeah. Never ever be inferior to. You know, that's okay. not a problem. It's kind of like your significant other says, hey, I'm going to go with Malik. He ain't tripping. He knows Malik. Married, got kids, this and that. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm going to go with Bucky Terrence to the bar. Well, hold up. Well, just so you know, though, people usually cheat down. I was going to say that because men don't care men, who people, they cheat with. If you actually look at it, so they, so people usually cheat down. They don't yes. usually cheat with somebody better or better looking than a significant other, better body, better job. It's usually down. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and say that. I was just saying that I expect it. Okay, y'all, I am finished with the podcast. Everything went well. I actually came back home. Got the fam, and now I'm starving, so we're gonna go um, grab a bite to eat. Uh, I don't know, just somewhere, it's about lunchtime right now, so just somewhere good for lunch. And then I think we're gonna go, it's Memorial Day weekend, so I know like stores are having sales and stuff, so we might go to a couple of furniture stores, cause I'm looking for like, um, well I'm looking for a rug, but I'm also looking for like a nice, um, picture or artwork to go over my entryway table so I might just go there and see if I can find anything but anyway right now we're just gonna go get something to eat a lot of people out here today Got to the mall and um, there's a restoration hardware in here so I'm just gonna check it out real quick and see if they have anything that I like in here. Isn't this so cute? Look how they have it set up. It's so cute out here. So this is our actual bed that we currently have now and we have these nightstands also. I love how they styled it with the skinny mirrors going up. I think we might end up doing that. Uh, I think Okay guys, I am loving this bench right here. Look how good it, look how cute it is actually. I think I would put this in my closet um, up against the window because I do have like just like a extra space right there. But isn't it so cute? Look at this bathroom. 
I love the light fixture too. This is so cute. Here's another look at that bench. It's like a velvet. Okay, I'm looking at these throw pillows for the couch. I love the color, they're so nice. I actually really like the rug also. This coffee table is amazing. Look how beautiful that is. Look at that. I want to I want to return my furniture and get this couch instead, but obviously I I don't feel like dealing with all that, but look how amazing that looks. Ah, oh, gorgeous. Hey guys. All right, so I'm back in the car and I don't know why I went into RH because I already knew. Anyway, I got in there and I saw some stuff and I was like, oh my gosh, this is so cute. I wanted to like just return the furniture that I have now and um, order something different from RH, but uh, it just gets confusing. That's why I just need to, Turn left onto Kelly I just need to stop looking at furniture. I already have furniture, but anyway. In Restoration Hardware, I did order a rug, um, so you guys will see that whenever it comes in. It takes about two weeks. But I saw these really um, cute ottomans that I absolutely love, and I was thinking that it would look really nice in front of the sliding glass doors in the living room. Because if I, I think I told y'all like one of the first vlogs that I was actually getting a different couch. Um, it was going to be a single sofa versus a sectional. So there would be um, a space by the window and I would just put like two really cute um, ottomans there. So they had one that I liked at Restoration Hardware. I didn't purchase it yet. I'm gonna go by our house first to see if they have anything similar and then just kind of decide from there. But so now I'm on my way to our house furniture. But yes, every time I go in Restoration Hardware, I about lose my mind. So I'm really excited for the rug and I can't wait for you guys to see it. Um, so yeah, now we're heading to our, um, our house. We are at our house. Okay guys, um, I am back at home. I am tired and exhausted. So I went to our house and um, was basically trying to see um, what my options are were because I'm thinking about um, returning something that I actually I ordered it. I haven't even received it yet. I already placed the order. I was waiting for it to be delivered. But um, I went in to cancel that because there's something else that I like at Restoration Hardware that I think I'm going to go with instead. So I've come to the conclusion that I need to just stop looking at furniture because every time I go into a furniture store, I see something that I like and I'm like, oh, I should have gotten that and I just can't keep like going back and forth with everything. So anyway, I'm done. Um, I just, I love restoration hardware, but when I was looking at couches and stuff at the time, I just didn't see one that I really liked like in the actual showroom. So when I went to our house and I saw that one, I was like, I love it. But then today when I go in there, they had, I guess they had redid the showroom and they had like a whole little grouping with the couch and the rug and the coffee table. And I was just like, oh my God, this is amazing. But obviously I can't return all my furniture. So anyway, but I did get a rug from Restoration Hardware, like I told y'all. So that should be delivered soon. And I'm, I did find something that I like there and I'll show y'all that when that comes. But anyway, I am tired. Um, my initial reason for going out looking at stuff today is because I was looking for something to put um, above the my console table in the foyer, the entryway. I did see something at Restoration Hardware, but I mean, it was a painting for like, it was like $2,900 and I was just like, Oof. I don't know, that's just a lot. So I'm gonna keep looking. I mean, I don't mind spending money on certain pieces, but I, I just, I don't know. For me, that was just like a, a lot just for a picture. So I'll keep looking. But that was the main reason why I went out looking today. I'm gonna go online and see what I can find. I, I also get stuff from like Wayfair and stuff too, but here lately, everything I've ordered from Wayfair, whenever I got it in, it's like the quality's off and I've been returning stuff. But I'm going to see what they have at Wayfair as far as like accessories and stuff um, for the entryway and stuff like that. Anyway, so I am at home now and I am tired. 
I think um, we're just gonna watch a movie. Out of nowhere, we had thunderstorms, so it's like raining outside. So anyway, uh, tomorrow is Memorial Day, so I hope everyone has a safe and fun Memorial Day, and I will talk to you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I know it was a quick one. Um, I tried to vlog as much as possible, but then when I started working with the salespeople, it just got a little bit much, and the stores were a little bit busy today. So I'm learning this whole vlogging thing, so just bear with me. I'll get better at vlogging. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.